quick fo footnote here. You're about to go to the past. This is the advent calendar that time almost forgot. Time being me and me being a drunken idiot. Okay, I, was, I did a video for Christmas Eve and then I was uploading videos counting them and I was short by one. And I went back and realized I didn't edit this video. So this one should have been, I believe, around day 10 or 12. It's, so it's a bit in the past, but hey, as we approach the new year, why don't we look back into the past, even if it is only a week or so in the past. So on to the past. Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to today's advent calendar. I was about to use this guy, but I feel dust in the bottom. You need to be washed. Uh, let's grab, oh, how about on brand? Here we go. Anyways, so yeah, just sitting around, I did clean up a little bit here. Uh, you see it's a bit more organized. Now I just, I just think I moved most of the mess here to the living room. So now I gotta move that somewhere else. And eventually I'll just have one room that's messy. There's football for you, American football, of nice and snowy, so. Uh, yeah, anyways, I did do some shopping today. Got myself some Where in the World's Carmen San Diego, uh, Jordan versus Bird, MTV Remote Control. I'm not sure if I have this one already. And the Holland Grove trousers. I bought my nephew a bunch of games since they have a PS3, so I still want to get them. Um, uh, what should I call it? Uh, Shadow of the Colossus. But this one here, I'm not too sure about. It is rated M. And I don't know if his mother will let him, but I mean, it's pretty tame of a game. Uh, compared to, I know he's been watching uh, the Fractured But Whole playthroughs on YouTube, so I mean, that by comparison is a, <laughs> is a kiddie game. So anyways, but yeah, so just sitting around, got the tree up, also a bunch of other presents. I got for the little ones, so they're getting harder and harder to uh, uh, buy presents for. Oh, and I got myself something, just randomly. Hello, are you still there? <laughs> yep. Otherwise, I need to start on the project if I'm going to do it in the backyard. Uh, I have some ideas. I just need to plan through. So I don't know if I'm going to get that done this Christmas, but I am home for um, got confirmation that the show I'm doing, I was doing next week is gone. So I'm basically home now until uh, the end of the year, basically. So one other thing I'm doing since essentially, hi, uh, this is a shaky vlog now. I don't do shaky vlogs because I have this, but uh, I'm doing some advent calendar. You see, there's the, uh, hello, can you see me? Am I on camera? Hmm? Hello. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm just setting up doing some, uh, uh, the holiday ones you can see with the uh, little uh, blue Santa hat there. So, anywho, there. How you doing? Because I'm wearing a Zenyatta T-shirt. Get it? It's a joke. Anyways, <laughs> if I have to explain it, no, skim. All right. So, this has been very random, but uh, I just thought I'd do this now. Get out of the way. I have fallen a little behind schedule because don't pay attention to when football is on. <laughs> It'll ruin the illusion. But today, I finally get to try Crown Royal. Uh, what is it? Oh no, this is just regular Crown. Ah! I've been had! Oh no! That also means you're not cold, are you? This is what I want to try. Crown Royal Vanilla. Shoot! You know what that means? All that I shot a bunch of footage of like, you know, my usual setup footage. Oh, there we go. See, like that. I did it for that guy. Shoot. Oh, well. That's what I get for not paying attention and grabbing the wrong kind of... Actually, you know what? Uh -uh. Anyways, no. What I mean is, let me get you out because this will be important. So, I can tell you how it tastes versus the regular one if there's any... Uh, bad, uh, blah, 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 blah. Any, whatchamacallit, difference in taste. But... That does mean I'm gonna have to change up the way I take it. Oh, by the way, I gotta, I'll show you that in another uh, advent calendar game. Darn bacon. Ugh. Anyways, so this is improvising. Let me set you down here so you can watch me pour nice and slowly. Look at that. 
And that was the right one, right? Yeah, okay. So yeah, again, if I hadn't said it, this is the Crown Royal uh, Vanilla. I've been wanting to test this for a while. So, so let's see. Uh, well, let me set it down here. There's a cup. So this is gonna be a little bit watered down, I'm afraid. Because a little bit of melted ice in it. So that's unfortunate, but it smells just like the crown. Matter of fact, again, for a comparison here. Let me open this up. Again, I'm doing this not strapped to my forehead because I like being able to see what I'm showing you guys. So so okay, so that's what crown smells like normally. Again, it's uh, kind of uh, this the generic one is hmm, I can't get a good whiff of it, but it's a little bit between the Irish and the bourbon uh, I want to say because there's hints of Well, it's a whiskey taste, but it's a bit lighter still than the I uh, than the bourbons and this is the vanilla It has a mellow taste, a smell to it, rather. And again, I don't know if that's because of the unfortunate ice incident, but again, most people will drink this on the ice. By the way, they're in, that game right there is actually happening just back there. Again, I'm next door to the stadium, so. So yeah, that's just down the street, as it were. So, anyways. So, this video has been, how long has this video been? Five minutes. And I still haven't really gotten to the shot yet. Mm. But yeah, since I'm doing some, um shooting i thought it'd be a good time to drink so but yeah yeah so here's to uh getting shopping done kind of a bit early again what i have 10 days or so before christmas so yay <laughs> so here we go here again i've been looking for it i want because i got this and i've heard people speak uh praise of it so i'm curious to see how it tastes myself so here we go again i'm moving to my forehead just for <laughs> Uh, just for tradition, so uh, to getting Christmas shopping done. Okay, 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 there's the warmth going down the chest. So, compared to yesterday, especially smooth still there so the initial taste is that of crown it's nothing fancy nothing different just crown surrounding it is hints of vanilla but then you get that warmth and whiskey taste and everything kind of goes like that so again i can only talk with one hand in this setup i wish there was a way i could just strap you know uh like a clip system just clip to my forehead and clip out so anyways but back to the uh so warmth Again, kind of top of the mouth, down the back of the throat, through the things. The aftertaste, and mixed up as it goes down, is a stronger vanilla taste. So, mm. and it's not, say, vanilla ice cream. Mmm, vanilla. And it's barely, say, vanilla seasoning vanilla. It's more of a, again, it's still a hint, but it's a stronger hint of um, vanilla and that lingers a bit longer than the whiskey taste so you're kind of left with a light whiskey taste with a bit of a stronger vanilla taste as the aftertaste so again like most whiskeys that goes great with a coke product or pepsi whichever you prefer so say you have cherry pepsi you want a little bit of vanilla there you go but again it's very subtle it's not a strong note of anything, and if anything, it's more of an aftertaste of vanilla than it is an initial taste of vanilla, like, say, the cinnamon whiskeys. Like, even Cinnamon Jack tastes like Jack with cinnamon, but it's right forefront, it's right as you drink it, so, hmm. Hmm, interesting. Again, not bad. Again, I like Crown. I always have the, um, and I might get that also in a bigger bottle now that I know about it. I always have the Apple one here, so. Again, again, I mix the apple whiskey with the cinnamon, and there you go, we have apple cinnamon, so. Nice, oh well, that was a bit of a hiccup in the system. So I need to put you back and I'll use you for something else later on, probably. I mean, I could cook with you. I mean, you are just good whiskey. 
Yeah, I remember I bought one of these guys because initially I was going to do a comparison taste depending on how the initial vanilla tasted, but it tasted similar to that. I mean, there's not a lot of a difference to it. Oh yeah, I was going to use you for tea. I still need to do that. Anyways, all that aside, that was today's advent calendar whiskey. Uh, hopefully, now that I'm back home, mm. excuse me, that's my, uh, the whiskey coming back up on me. Now that I'm back home, now I can get back to doing a game right after this one. So, stay tuned for that one. Uh, let me know if you've done your Christmas shopping ahead of schedule or if you wait last minute all the time. Let me know if you too have mastered playing with balls. Ah, oh, that's a forced joke. Uh, you have a bunch of the old ones here from the other ones. Oh, well, they're all kind of taped up there. Oh, well. Anyways, all that aside, I'll get back to playing these video games in VR, and I'll see you tomorrow, if not in the next video. Bye!